And uh, the first question that I would like to ask you is, uh, what do you think? What sorts of people work as project managers? I think that flows quite nicely from our from our previous chat. Um, so I think people who make good project managers have to be people people. Um, so they have to like interaction with other members of the human race. Um, and as you said, sort of increasingly online or via electronic communication, not so much like the old days where it would be on the phone or in person, although there is still quite a lot of in-person communication, especially if you're in the office and you're sort of walking around. Or um, So, yeah, you have to like people. You have to um, be really energized by fast paced environment um you have to be really good at multitasking and again enjoy multitasking and and sort of find energy and strength in lots of different priorities and lots of different tasks and lots of different skill sets um to enjoy learning and um yeah to and and to it's a sort of cliche um, that is in every job description but you work well under pressure is is a, is a significant sort of an aspect. And what I mean by that is enjoy working under pressure. It's no good if you work well under pressure, but you get, come home every night and you cry. Um, you might come home some nights and cry, but you know, there's a, there's a balance. Um, I think every job is, every job is like that. Um, yes. <laughs> so what you were talking about in terms of sort of the fulfillment and the achievement and the, the, um, the sense of having sort of provided a, something for people um I think you have to want that and you have to you know you have to enjoy the expectation that you're it and and you and you really are it as the project manager you know you're the conductor of the orchestra or you're the captain of the ship or you know pick your metaphor you're the project manager in a subtitling company um you're the person who's pulling all the threads together and juggling all the balls and spinning all the plates all at once all of those three things um and it has to be fun so you know you have to be the sort of person who finds that fun and at the end of the day you know when you deliver to the client and they're happy or you watch you know you see your your content on television or you know in the cinema or on the on the internet whatever you you feel a sense of achievement you know that that you you don't go oh god that was a nightmare (laughs) (laughs) definitely sometimes you do but mostly you don't mostly you don't you know those those projects are few and far between where you sort of you know talk about them years later and oh my god um but you mostly you you think yeah, that was great. We did a good job. And 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 there were, you know, there were five problems, but we solved them all and the client didn't even know. And, you know, it was great. Or, you know, well, the client didn't know, but they were really pleased with our solution. So I think you have to be that sort of person. Um, and if you're not, it's fine. It's absolutely fine. You know, be, be a subtitler and don't talk to people and sit in your pajamas, as you said. Of and course. that's also fine. We need those people too. Yes, <laughs> you are totally right. Yeah. I yeah. think what you mentioned, right, fun, is the word right you, uh, apart from everything else obviously right you need to remember that this job should bring you satisfaction right and it should be fun, yeah, fun. so those yeah. this may be experience on different levels yeah. definitely yeah. <laughs>